I'm on that. I'm on that. Hey, so you got clout. So you got clout. I'm on that. Say, I'm on that. Hey, got to set up a light. And that's alright. So hard, they supporting the couples out of these moves. Let me hit snooze, time for me to get up, get bust. I ain't got time to be stuck. You've been escaping, but there's so many tickets up. It's been an honor, the blessing, I don't believe in luck. Um, like I said, uh, we're talking a lot about your acting. Uh, yeah. Last year, you had a very successful independent film that you starred in. Yeah, yeah. That I came to see the premiere of, by the way. Oh, yeah, The Other uh, Side. The yeah. Other Side. Yes, sir. Uh, a little story about that, too. Mm-hmm. I had lost my keys uh, before your event. Um, you know, uh, I lost the key to unlock and lock my door. I just had, I only oh, had, car keys? I, yeah, I only had my spare key. Oh, so no. when I had came out to see you, yeah. I I just left my car unlocked in the parking lot, you know, just because I wanted to show support. That's support, know? man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I didn't stay as long as I wanted to mm-hmm. because I was like, let me get back to my car before somebody steal my shit. So I literally could have hot wired my shit and got the fuck off. Oh, outside night. of the venue? Yeah. Oh, yeah, because I, you know, I had part, um, you know, I didn't park right outside. I parked like a little down the street. You know how Atlanta is. Um, but yeah, no, 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 no. Like I was nervous like the whole time. I was like, damn, I hope like this movie don't come on too late. Which so, it kinda came on like an hour and a half. But it wasn't that bad though. No. I mean, cause I mean at the end of the day, I, I, my car was fine. You okay, know, that, facts, facts. My car was fine. But I just want you to know, mm-hmm. for my people, when I support you, I do support you because I left my car completely unguarded to support my boy. That's it, man. I appreciate it. I never knew that story. Yeah, I know. I, 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 want, I wanted to say, hey. I gave you an exclusive. I just dropped an exclusive hey. on you. <laughs> hey, you talking about? Yeah. <laughs> hey, you talking about? Yeah, man. But talk to me about the other side. Yeah, yeah. Um, what is it what, uh, now? Like, what, what's going on with that movie now? The other side, it had a successful, I think, um, uh, 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 film festival run. I think they're going to, the director, uh, Mike Morris, and the producer slash writer, um, Hope McCullough. Maybe she go. I think it's she has like a lot of aliases because she's like a creative and she's multifaceted. Mm-hmm. So Hope McCullough or uh, Brielle Epo. But anyway, um, I think they're gonna submit it. You know, this next round of film festivals. Mm-hmm. You know, it got accepted into um, uh, one in Toronto, Canada, one in okay. uh, Texas, and one some other place I forgot. Uh, I want to say it was Philadelphia or Chicago. Mm-hmm. So um, yeah, man, I think it was cool. It was cool. Okay, yeah. what, what was that experience like for you? Well, this is my first, your first lead, yeah, my right? First yeah. Lead, yeah, yeah. And for those who, for some reason, don't exactly know how that goes, like the credits, lead, co-star, guest star, supporting role, that means I was the main character, and the story was around me. So uh, that was my first one of those, bro. So that was a totally different experience. Uh, totally no, different for experience. those who don't know the other side, uh, how would you describe like the plot? The plot. All right. So Jeremiah, which is my my character, um, he was. Uh, Hate to say it, but he was at the wrong place at the wrong time, trying try to do the right thing. So grab me. Go ahead, grab, grab your snack. So Jeremiah was at the wrong place, wrong time. And, um, you know, he just, 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 just got shot by the cops. It was real bad, real. Yeah, yeah. It, it, it and really... I did that just because I didn't want to get teary eyed about it, bro. Because it's a real thing. Yeah. Like, I fe- speaking of, sorry to kind of cut corners, but Go ahead. when I was on the stretcher, um, filming the the scene. You know, post me getting shot by the police. Mm-hmm. That moment was so real for me, man. I was sitting there. I'm sorry. I was sitting there trying to. Um, as actors, it's our job to really internalize and like personalize everything that's on that script. You want to feel it all. True. But I was feeling too much of it. Mm-hmm. We were not even shooting, and like I'm in there trying to keep myself from like crying too much, and I was shaking. It, it was real. I was like, yo. This could really have been me. This could have really been me on this stretch right yeah. now. And it was, it was like, what's my mom gonna think? You know what I mean? I didn't get time to call my little brother. I didn't get time to call, you know, my friends and family, and say goodbye, like let them know what happened. Like so many people get taken off this earth, you know, from you know senseless stuff, like the police mm-hmm. officers abusing their authority and stuff, and they don't get this chance to say goodbye. And like, how, and I just thought about how that would affect people around me. Right. And it was, that was crazy. Right. That was crazy. Right. Yeah, and that, that's how I think about it too because all those people had something to do the next day every one of them you know and had a daughter and every, stuff everybody had lives you know so I, I was just I, walking I down the street yeah. my character and, and uh, uh, a young uh, white lady she was getting wrapped up in the alley and so naturally me being a man you know I tried to protect her and the 
the antagonist, the, robber, the bad yeah. guy, you know, Robin, yeah. whatever. The robber, he what you he, he shot her, and so I was kneeling down trying to, you know, help her. And the police came, and of course they thought the black guy did. Yeah, the the, other, the robber ran away. Yeah, ran away. And so it was all the cops seen was a black guy standing over this woman. That's it. He didn't see it, any weapon on him. He just seen a black guy. Hey, in a, twisted in, in a twisted way, uh, I I could for 0.3 seconds realize how a cop could assume that you know the brother was you know at fault for shooting the person because if all you see is a person on the ground, you see a person standing there, you're gonna automatically assume they had something to do with it. Right. My issue took uh, my, the issue I took place with. I took issue with <laughs> the fact that I was shot, mm -hmm. like shot. Yeah. And then, you know, eventually killed. You could have arrested me. You could have tased me. There were so many different things. They yeah, could have done. just I got, got the shot story straight. Because yeah. I moved. Because I moved, and he was threatened. He was yeah. threatened because I was a black man. Yeah. And so that's pretty much the whole synopsis of the the, the movie. Um, you 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 thought that I actually was not killed at that moment. I was shot. Yeah. And you see kind you see kind of how uh, events unfolded. Yeah. And at the very end. Once they the cops found me, yeah. you realize that I, this was all like in my imagination. I yeah. was actually killed, and they show how I died. At how the you end. died? Yeah, that that, was I like that little twist that, that you put at the end. Yeah. How long did it take to film that? Um, four months, like total. Yeah. I think one full month we shot like most of the stuff, but uh, we had to do some pickup scenes and whatnot. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I get it. Okay. So, um, I mean, I've started in multiple other projects since then, but I appreciate it. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, no. That, that, was, that was the first. That was the first. It's been a good year for you then? Man, God is good. I ain't gonna complain. God is good. Complain. All the time. All the time. All the time. Just, Amen. Just a couple more things, man. Um, yeah, I'm just you brought up, you know, your family several times in this interview. Mm -hmm. And uh, if anybody knows anything about Sean here, uh, Sean it's that... Uh, you can still call me Derek, man. Anyone who I'm knows trying to me, respect the know, change. Anyone who knows me, I meant to say that. Anyone who knows me... Call me Derek. Call okay, me something yeah. weird. That's yeah. just the name professional. I'm trying. I'm trying to just respect the, the, the lifestyle. That's, That's all, it. man. That's um, um, you post about your little brother, your baby brother. How old yeah. is he? He uh, he just turned seven. Like, seven. A like, week and a half ago. Like years. nobody's business, right? Yeah, that's my boy. And, uh, <laughs> and 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 um, you come. It comes off like um, like he's you know, your kid. Yeah, like he's your kid, and like you, you you're very, 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 very loving and like yeah. just supportive. It's a good. It's a good look. Like nothing. Nothing negative to say about it. Yeah. But like, um, it, 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 are you that way towards him? Because like, you know, just because the age difference. Um, like, how, how how's your relationship with like, with your siblings in general? Like, how are you? Are, are you just using them like pickup girls? No. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> Put, put, he, Derek posts you a different do, type of thirst you, trap. You do get a lot of attention. Yeah, he, he posts yeah, a different type of thirst of trap. You know, you, you put a little kid mm, on camera and gush over, and you know, know, I'm sure if he, the DMs you know, fill up real quick. Yeah, you know, you know. But, you know, you know. But, um, <sighs> but I was single, I'd do it. Yeah, man, first thing, I'm one of like 11 kids. Oh, okay. Let me okay. count this to make sure I'm not wrong. Rodney, Derek, myself, Shout uh, Demise, Shout Dierre, Shout Kayla, Shout Jonathan, Shout uh, Ryan, Shout Bunny, Shout Savior, Shout Kaylin. Shout so I'm one of ten. Um, so you're one of ten. One, one of ten, including you. But yeah, including me is ten. Okay. But one of those is by marriage, and it blood don't make us no closer. She's been a part of my family since I was like, well, since she was zero years old. Right. Okay. Um, uh, and then I have three by my. Uh, like kind of outside of that but they're still my family it's by marriage you know what I mean okay okay and so okay. those are still my sisters you know my brothers yeah. everything same right. but now nah, man um, I will admit that I don't have as close of a bond with all of them because we're all grown we're doing our own thing yeah. <clears throat> and that's something I want to work on even going in the whole freedom thing and like that's what I want to be in the world is free I want my relationships with my people who are really you know, uh, uh, close to me, or they should be close to me. Yeah. I want those relationships to grow tighter. Yeah. And so, um, but yeah, I, I'm not as close with them as I could be because we're all doing our own thing. But right. my brother, that's I guess that's kind of like my. I don't know. I think because he's so young mm -hmm. and uh, just growing up now and being older, I see that how important it is to have a uh, uh, a solid, healthy, you know, I mean, nurturing environment. And how that's really going to shape a kid, you know, to be the best that he could be. And so I made it my business. I made that my personal. <clears throat> so I'm getting. 
I see. Up. My I bad. See. But no, I, you I said I'm going to be the best big brother I can be because I know he needs it. And if we don't even have a village, he's going to have me. To the rocks fall off, to the wheels fall off. I don't care if he fails every grade. I don't care if he works at McDonald's and, and quits the day after. I don't care if he never goes to college. Big brother Derek is going to always have his back, and that's it. I want him to have that consistent, loving figure in his life. Better get on his butt, but still, you know, he knows that he has one person on this earth who has his back always. And so that's my... <laughs> More thirst trapping, I see. <laughs> yeah, all right, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm joking, but I gotta make sure you're straight. Yeah, all right? okay, cool, cool. Yeah, we, 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 we yeah, 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 that's 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 my boy, man. Okay, that's, that's cool, that's cool. Yeah. Um, one more. Young team been working so hard, they supporting the couples out of these moves. Let me hit the schools, time for me to get up. Get bust, I ain't got time to be stuck. You've been the same other buddies, so many tickets up. It's been an honor, the blessing, I don't believe in luck. I'm ready for my son, yeah